guys, Ro here, and in the past, I've done videos about beavers, birds, and bears. He's just a kid. I'm just here with Frank. But Rowan Ellsmore has many stories to tell. I'll be asking him some questions about bees and beekeeping. It's fun coming up with a new story to tell every week. This right here is what Frank calls his best workers. Rowan's 12. Pack of the bees. The same age as the world's most famous video sharing website. I love creating content on YouTube. Here, Rowan's known by a different name. My YouTube name is Average Row. I'm literally just an average kid who's growing up in Ottawa. I live in a neighborhood near a pond. But there's nothing average about Row's following. He's got over 2,300 subscribers. And you're coming up to a big number, right? Yeah, he's uh, getting close to 100,000 views, which is unbelievable. So here you can actually see... Especially because Row and his dad... All of the sap that we saw have only been telling stories here's the wagon rides coming up for a year and a half he had been saying many many times that he wanted to start a youtube channel so good and then one day i just decided to buy a camera and i uh, picked him up from school and i said okay let's go let's film and it never stopped two one oh, again! how much did you know about the world of shooting and editing and telling stories um, next to nothing. But Ro knew what he wanted his stories to be about. What was that? Life growing up well, in well, Ottawa through the eyes of a 12-year-old. Today, I'm dog sledding through the Canadian wilderness. So, once a week, he began sharing those adventures with the world. I like videos that are very Canadian. The dog sledding video, that was a lot of fun. Another video that I loved was the Ganaraska salmon fishing video. Hey, good job! So this right here is a coho salmon. I'm just about to be interviewed for the regional contact. So excited. He turned his TV experience that's, with us that's that's Joel. <laughs> into an episode. So I'm here with Joel Haslam right now. At turned me from an interviewer. I thought that I'd switch the roles and interview you. Sounds good. To interviewee. Do you have any tips for aspiring travel journalists like myself? So today I'm doing something really interesting. And using his camera to learn about others has taught Ro a few things about himself. About taking chances and not being afraid. You have such a natural sense of curiosity and you just love to explore and see the world. Before this also, I was actually the kind of person who wouldn't take opportunities because I would overthink them so much to the point where I would be paralyzed to do anything because I was afraid of the negative outcomes. He used to be um, all think and no do. Uh, now he's a doer that thinks, so it's, it's fantastic. Rose excited to tell many more stories, logging his ideas in his favorite journal. It says, stay humble, hustle hard. For now, he's happy really to cool. be a kid in life and on YouTube. Thank you all so much. Man. His dream job. If I can make a living, that would be amazing. If I don't, it doesn't bug me because I'm doing what I love. And if I get paid to do that, then that's a bonus. I'm Joel Haslam for Regional Contact.